Hey yo, what is going on guys, Temple here, in this video I'll be teaching you guys on how to make a free custom YouTube banner. So there's a lot of people that don't have Photoshop already, so this is for the people that don't want to crack Photoshop illegally or anything like that. So yeah, ho hope you do enjoy this video, if you could leave a like on this video, I'll definitely make some more videos like on how to like make a logo for free, how to make a thumbnail for free. And yeah, this is all to do with Panzoid. Thank you, Panzoid. Um, their link will be down below. So yeah, just go on your internet browser and type in Panzoid. Exactly how I spelt it there. And then you want to click on the first link up here, Panzoid.com. And as you can see, I taught you last video on the community templates, their intros, and yeah, more intros. There's a video editor. It's pretty amazing. Uh, I'll teach you on how to do that later like um, a couple of videos later and the one we're going to be going on is called background of free um the description of it is create free custom youtube channel art twitter backgrounds and more so you want to just click on that link and it should load up something like this but um without this loaded up so i'll show you what that looks like right now so yeah it'll just be like everything else on here like not close not open I'm just going to click this thing where my mouth is right now and that will just open it. So now you can start from scratch or load say a template. There might be some YouTubers on the internet that actually make pans with templates. So go um, search that up. You can save your template and then post it on Panzoid for other people to like help, um, get help. So yeah, the one I'm going to be using from this custom templates is um, this one down here, the bottom one. Actually, we're gonna go for the basics right now. So you can change your background color, clicking on it, pull it to red, and click OK. You can do whatever you want with that. I'm just gonna leave that as black. Um, yeah, YouTube one, there's a YouTube channel art, YouTube thumbnail, Twitter, Facebook cover, photo, and video frame. I guess that's for like videos and all that stuff. So yeah, go to layer one. And as you can see, that's everything in there. Um, and now we're going to go to text and images. And now we're going to change the text to what your name is. Tempo Arts. We're going to put Tempo there. And then press Enter. Make sure you press Enter, guys, or it will not come up. And we're going to use their font that they wanted us to use, like that. And now we're going to go to Overlays. And you can just choose whatever overlay you want. So like that that looks pretty sick now you can do whatever you want with this guys it's pretty sick software to do you can upload an image um, select a file so I'm gonna select a file real quick so I'm just gonna put in this pumpkin picture for no reason but yeah I'm just showing you how to import stuff so yeah it's pretty sick as you can like import you could import text if you made your own cinema 4d text into here pretty sick software as it is for free users and free users only so yeah you can just go to text and images and you could place it in from here as well so you can make your own gradients and i'll be showing you guys how to do that right now so you want to double click at the end here so i'm going to move that over right there so you want to double click on the on the black bit and it'll make a you know something there like that and I'm gonna delete that because I don't want it yeah there we go so now we're gonna click on the first bit it's a bit like Photoshop but obviously you guys don't have Photoshop if you're watching this so we're gonna put that to like that code right there and like put it kind of light and then click OK and we're gonna go to the, the other one click on that I'm gonna put it to the same red but a bit darker and then click OK as you can see it makes a nice effect and we're gonna put gradient angle to three thickness to one and bang that is what we're going to use you can put blow on there but i don't see the reason for doing so i just want it to stand out um that's how you make a free banner guys if you did enjoy this video drop a like on this video that'd be highly appreciated and yeah i'll see you guys next time peace out